Welcome back to Booze and Rocks, where we make a cocktail for everyone. My name is David Edwards, and today we make a blue margarita. Let's get into it. All right, it's great to have every single one of you back here today. We are making a blue margarita. And why? Because it's Margarita Monday, and that's pretty awesome. So for those of you that are new to the channel, every other Monday, I make a margarita that's either sent in from you, the viewer, I create or I find online or through some books. And you know what? This is awesome because the winner here is you. You get to try out different margaritas and different flavors and you get to send some recipes in and we share them and everybody gets to try this out. So I was thinking to myself, I need to do a blue cocktail because I love blue cocktails. If you don't like blue cocktails or you do like them, please leave a comment down below. And while you're at it, hit that like button. So I was thinking to myself, self, how can I combine the two? And I said, well, that's easy, blue curacao. Oh, magic! And then I realized what else has to go in there. So I sat down and I thought about it, thought about it, I thought about it, went online, checked a few things, came back, and I didn't like the recipes I saw online. So this is my recipe, and let's try it out. First thing you need is your shaking glass, and this is pretty awesome. So you wanna grab your tequila of choice. In this case, I'm using Altos Omeka and it's a white or silver tequila. You can change the types of tequila you want. You could go with Anejo, which is extra old, or Reposado tequila, totally up to you. And for this, we're going to use two ounces or 60 milliliters. All right. The next thing that we need is a little bit of blue curacao. Now, blue curacao is an orange liqueur. This is also what is going to give us our blue color. And one of the things you have to remember with uh, blue curacao is that it is a sweeter liqueur. And for this, we need one ounce or 30 milliliters. Ooh, look at that. It's looking pretty good so far. Next thing you're going to do is grab your lime of choice. In this case, I finally have a decent sized lime. Grab your knife slice it in half and what i'm going to do interestingly enough is i'm going to look at that and go oh that's really pretty but i'm going to cut a lime wedge and you're looking at that and you're thinking to myself david you cut it in the wrong direction no that's okay that's my garnish so what we're going to do is squeeze this out using our squeezer and for this we need one ounce or 30 milliliters Put this over here, aha. Now, I did say that we needed a little bit of agave syrup. And because the blue curacao is sweeter, a lot of the recipes I saw had a half an ounce or more of simple syrup. What I'm going to use is agave syrup, and we're going to use a quarter of an ounce or seven and a half mils. Now your average bar spoon is a five mil spoon. So all you wanna do is just have a little bit extra. And then just, you wanna make sure you just stir that a little bit with your spoon just to get the, uh, the syrup off there. Grab that, throw that over there. And now what we're gonna do is we're going to grab some ice and we're gonna shake this for a good 10 to 15 seconds. Slam it down, give it a little flip and shake it hard with a smile. All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna shake it till it's nice and cold and frosty. Slap it with the strength of a thousand limes. And I actually got a little bit of the uh, liquids all over the place when I uh, dropped the ice in, so I'll wipe that down. So what we need now is your glass of choice. In this case, I'm going to use a rocks glass. I really like them. Use whatever you want. If you want something fancy, totally up to you. Grab some salt. Grab your leftover lime husk. And what we're going to do is we're going to just wet half of the rim of the glass. And the reason I only use half of the glass is not everybody likes to have a mouthful of salt when they drink their tequila cocktails. And look at that, nice, pretty, we'll put that there. Grab your Hawthorne strainer and a fine strainer. Move those over there because I forgot to put the ice in there. 
So you want to grab some ice? And, you know, make it look good. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Take your lime wedge and just put that on top and give it a garnish. Look at that. That says blue. And it says margarita. Now the good thing about this is if you don't find your margarita sour enough, you can squeeze this lemon lime in here. And I just call it a lemon, it's a lime. And you can adjust the taste accordingly. So the first things you smell are a little bit of the tequila. It's not overpowering. You get a little bit of the orange from the blue carousel. Mm, that's really good. It's not oversweet. It's balanced very, very nicely. Um, in fact, it's not sweet at all. It's just that lower shade to tart. It's quite nice. Now let's try this with a little bit of salt. Mm. Oh, you know what? It's great both ways. Oh, and then you get that salt follow-up. Oh, oh yeah. Mm. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the ingredients and a method of how to make this down in the description down below. If you think I should use a different tequila or a different type of curacao, you could change this. You don't have to go blue, but go blue in my preference. Leave that down in the comments below as well. And you know what? If this is your first time to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit that bell notification. That way, every time we put up a new video, you will be notified. And if you're interested in supporting the channel, please check us out at patreon.com forward slash booze on the rocks. And you have a great afternoon. Welcome back to booze on the rocks. My name is David Edward and here we make the other fact is who doesn't love a blue cocktail? I know I do, and I hope you do too. You know what, leave a comment down below and let me know if you love, if you doesn't love a blue cocktail. Please leave a comment down below and let me know whether you like blue margaritas